Hey friends, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Anar and I'm a self-taught software developer. On this channel, I help you break into and grow in the tech industry. There's one question that gets asked a lot in the comment section, so I thought I would address it here today. The question is, how do I get a job as a software developer in Canada without any Canadian experience? From what I picked up in the comments, the people actually asking this question do have a few years of experience, they're just not currently in Canada and thinking about moving to Canada. Regardless of how much experience you have, I will answer this question for you today and I'll tell you exactly what your hiring manager is going to be looking for when they interview you. This way you can increase your chances of actually getting the job. So let's start with the technical skills. If you're a software developer that was developing software in Java for example, it doesn't really matter if you were doing this in India, Europe or the US. Your technical skills are just as valid in Canada as they are in the country that you're currently working in, so nothing to worry about there. The number one concern when looking over a resume that has only foreign experience is that there may be a potential communication gap between the current team members and this new candidate. I remember when I was helping a VP recruit, we would look at applicants together and the main reason that some applicants did not get offers was because the VP was worried that there may be a communication problem. Therefore, clear communication is something you should focus on and this should start with your resume. You want your resume to be clear, concise, and short. Explain what you achieved in your work experience. Quantify your achievements by saying something like reduced cost by 20% or reduced execution time by 200%. Compress your resume to one or two pages. You don't want to lose the attention of the hiring manager. If your English is not strong, I would suggest putting some effort into improving it. I had one colleague that was a new immigrant from Brazil and when he started, his English was not very strong but he joined conversation groups where they would meet up weekly and do activities to improve their English. His English and communication skills improved significantly over time and this is something I would recommend you do as well because as I mentioned, communication skills are very important, especially for applicants with only foreign experience. You also want to get your resume out there as much as possible. One general tip is to apply on jobbank.ca. I'll leave a link in the description. JobBank is a Canadian job board that's specifically meant for new immigrants. Then make sure you hit the main Canadian job boards, Indeed and LinkedIn. If you haven't done so yet, create a clean, professional LinkedIn profile. You can search for software engineers in Canada on LinkedIn and have a look at their profile if you're just creating one yourself. Generally, a short about me section, a professional photo, your education, skills and experience should make for a clean LinkedIn profile. Once you have your LinkedIn profile, apply for jobs on LinkedIn, on Indeed, and once you run out of job postings on these two, apply on AngelList and Eluda. Eluda is an aggregator that will find job postings on company websites and other places, while AngelList is a job board specifically for jobs at startups. One more tip before I go, don't waste your time applying to jobs you're not qualified for. If you have at least 70% of the qualifications that the job posting is asking for and close to the number of years they're asking for, then it's a good job posting to apply to. This should be a good start. I'm going to wrap it up here and I'll see you in the next one.